Yo, what's up guys, welcome to another video, I hope you guys missed me, and by the title you've probably seen that in this video I will be talking about Infinite Warfare, yay, and in the background you guys can see um, the prize fighters, which we accomplished together as a community to get, and I actually got them on gold, and in this gameplay I will be completing the 400 melee kill challenge, and yeah, enough of that, um, Infinite Warfare is right around the corner, it's going to be here really soon and we are going to be playing Infinite Warfare in about two months time, well at least most of us. Um, many people are more hyped for uh, COD 4 Remastered but I'll leave that for another video and just before we start I just wanted to say that I'll be making a counter video to this one. Um, later on in the week so make sure to check that one out and yeah let's just get right into it the first thing is um, the main one that I'm hyped for um, infinite warfare so the first one is fan favorite weapons are back like from the trailers and from like YouTube videos and the developers and shit we got to know um, that many fan favorite and classic guns as they're called are coming back which at this time we only know about the Ripper and the Intervention and I am so happy about that I just like can get them flashbacks when I was playing Modern Warfare 2 on Rust and like destroying pussy with the in intervention and so I, I just can't wait for many other favorite guns of mine and surely other people if that's what they are gonna do I hope it's not classic weapons don't mean that it's gonna be like um, MP40 or just like Classic looking weapon, classic looking weapons. I hope it's not the case. I hope it's literally like fan favorite guns coming back, like the intervention and stuff. Okay, so the second thing is weapon variants. Um, weapon variants are more developed in Infinite Warfare. Um, the more worked at, and therefore there's a better system. I'm guessing um, to do with the weapon variants. And it's going to be a nice addition to what we had in Advanced Warfare. It's going to be like a build on that. I hope they make it right. I hope they're not too OP if they change any stats or just add the perks as I've seen in the trailers. I hope that's the case. And I hope they balance it out pretty good. Okay, so the next thing is um, proficiencies are back. What proficiencies are, if you guys played Modern Warfare 3, that's the only COD game proficiencies were at. Um, you would have known things like proficiencies. There was speed proficiencies, kick proficiencies, focus proficiencies and stuff like that. So by now, I'm already guessing you know what I mean. So that's coming back, which is really great. And another thing that we're going to go on to is old game modes are back, like Drop Zone, um, Gun Game. Um, I don't know which other ones, that's the main two I've heard about. And the last thing, which is the number five, it's crafting weapons. This is a completely new system developed, especially for um, Infinite Warfare. And from what we heard from the videos I watched and heard from interviews with the developers they said that it's gonna be just earning scrap in game with the gun and then being able to improve it and upgrade it to another level which is common rare legendary and epic I guess and yeah guys hope you guys enjoyed this short little video I tried to push it in as much as I could and hope you guys enjoyed have a great day it was Super Mikey signing out. Peace.
Defense throw. 